Okay, I have assembled before you. This is Alex, by the way. My, sorry about that. I have assembled before you my pathetic collection of homebrew disc container picking supplies, all of which are fails. This recent obsession with disc container started with this cursed Chinese lock sent by Bill, Bosnian Bill, as part of the traveling lock box. After many hours of futzing with it, I've concluded that it is superior to me in every way having to do with lock security. Now, I'm doing this video to try to ask for some help from somebody, anybody, maybe Solomon, maybe Bill, maybe Wizwazzle, maybe Kokomo, I don't know. Here are the tools that I have put together over the last almost year that I've been trying this. I have various pick type things. The one on the right is a key from another one of these Chinese locks that I thinned down and just left a little end. Decent feedback. This is one, it's kind of square. It sort of works. This little handle that I can use for different things. Um, I've got this one, which is a piece of brass. Um, silver soldered onto a little rod, but I think it's too thin. Um, then I've got this one, which is also a piece of brass, silver soldered or braced onto a piece of metal. This one has great feedback, grabs the disc great, but I can't always get it to slide into the little spaces. I can't always get it out, so I lose my sets. And um, the shaft takes up a little too much room. Then I saw Kokomo's video, and I made one of these, not nicely, not as well as he did, but um, this, you know, gets around in there great, but I can't get good purchase on the discs with this thing, so maybe I need to make it out of some thicker material or something else. I don't know. I don't have calipers here. Got that. So those are the pick-shaped things that I've tried. I've also tried wires and stuff and had no luck with that. Then for tension, um, this one is actually provides great tension, hangs on pretty well. It's a piece of like one eighth by one quarter inch steel bar that I bent and milled some of the, God, I hope that's in focus. Probably not. Milled and bent some of the, cut some of the material out and serrated it. So there's lots of room in there. So I get it in there and he actually got enough room to get a tool in and decent leverage, but it seems to... You know, I've got enough serrations I can grab just the discs I want, but it seems to take up too much room in the keyway. So then I tried one of these things, um, sort of a flat tension bar, and I made a couple different ends on it. I even tried making little... I don't know if you can see on this one, but I tried making little... Uh, grooves on the end. Come on now. To try to grab the disc better. This just kept slipping out and getting in the way. It would kind of cross over the QA too badly. This seems to be a winner actually, this tension bar. Um, this is a piece of 1 8 inch square steel stock that I have bent a 90 degree angle in I cut a oops. I cut a little slot notch in the corner, which predictably is that's not too bad. Um, there you can see the notch. Okay, that grabs onto the corner of the wheel. The end profile is kind of like this, so I removed material to leave room for the pick wire, and then I left the corners. So basically, I've relieved a little more than 50% of this side and then there's a little notch here and I made it a, the other end um, same idea but a little bit longer to reach inside some of these keyways but same idea lots of filing and so forth this seems to work really well except it bungs up the the discs a little the brass discs a little bit but um, yeah 
So I can post video of myself struggling through these locks, but uh, oh yeah, here's the other one that I made. This stupid thing. Um, this gets pretty good purchase, but having a tool this long doesn't work very well. Um, so I really don't want to have to go buy a stupid tool that probably doesn't work either, but um, I don't know. I've seen you guys do some pretty cool stuff with homebrew. Maybe you've got some suggestions. So I um, thought this would have potential, but not so much. Anyway, if anyone has any ideas, I'd really appreciate it. Um, uh, and uh, anyhow, but uh, yeah, that's all I got. So anyway, this is Alex. Um, thanks for your help. Have fun and keep it legal. Cheers.